Hi guys, and welcome back to possibly the very last episode of Waking Mars. Um, oh, there's one thing that I wanted to check before I went in there, and that was Megazoa. For some reason I'm still missing a research on Megazoa. I was hoping that it would come across... Great! Well, I guess I have absolutely no idea what either of those are. I was hoping it would give me at least some kind of hints, but I guess not. Well, fine. I guess that will just always be a mystery. So, here we are. So, what now? The sentients aren't saying anything. They are waiting. We must make a decision for them. Huh? Could you tell me what you've got figured out, Leon? Hmm. To us, this seems like a natural cave, but it is not to the sentients. So, what exactly? They built it? This cave was the sentient's home? I am unsure. Perhaps it was more like a last refuge. The surface became desolate, and life was forced underground. More importantly, I believe Lev Cavern is a kind of machine. It lay dormant until recently, when something caused it to awaken. Uh, okay, I guess I can see the machine angle. It's a machine for creating life. Or, no, wait, I guess you're the one who did all the growing. I accelerated the process. The machine is able to restore life to these caverns on its own, given time. That is one of its functions. Right, so its other function must have something to do with all this energy it's harvesting from the biomass you've grown. Okay, so what do the sentients want? Do they want their cave back? Their planet back? I don't know, something else? We cannot be certain. But I sense these monuments are the triggers. Enough power flows, the machine can be activated. That time is now. Core power is high enough. Um. Okay. Where's my objectives? How do I bring up objectives? Oh, return to the helm. Well. I guess we're going down here and activating this. This monument is powered. If I wait there for a moment, the machine will activate one of its functions. Let's do it! On oh, second thought, let's not. No, just kidding. Let's do it! I wonder what these do. Oh shit. Mistake! Mistake! Oh god, Leon, get off it! Get off it! Holy... Mars. Okay, Mars awake. We woke Mars. Wait, now what? Uh, let's see, what achievements do I not have yet? The journey begins. Okay, let's just wait for one of these to... Uh... Oh, you can't fast travel from here, so I guess... I guess I'm here for a reason. Where? Oh, hey. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That's a cool little screenshot area there. So I guess these were... What the hell are these things? Let's hope Armani is okay and has survived 
the terraforming of Mars. Huh. Well, let's have another hug. And another zoom out. Ah. Ain't that nice. So there's still a special ending to get. I guess that didn't count as a special ending? Maybe the special ending is you have to step on the left side thing. You know, that cavern there gave me a really big Sonic 1 vibe. You know at the end of Sonic 1, when he's running through Green Hill Zone and there's different plants and things alive, and then you, all the Chaos Emeralds come out and all that kind of stuff happens. Yeah, reminded me of that. That was pretty cool. Um, I guess that's it for that ending. Uh, what can I talk about while we're waiting for the cast? Because I kind of need to wait for it to reboot so I can go and do my, uh, try and get the other ending. Um, well, regardless, this will be the last video for Waking Mars, so uh, it's time for me to pick a new game. I think I know what I'm going to pick already, but maybe not. I might do a few little flash games in between, like, you know, to tide me over until the next game. Um, but we'll see. I don't know yet. We'll, we'll see what happens when, when this one is actually over. Which it isn't yet, because this cast is... Oh hey, there you go. Wow! Armani was voiced by the one who did the model for Armani. That's pretty cool. I guess it makes sense that they'd have to have models. They were quite quite well drawn little drawing painting-y things. The Waking Mars font. Oh, thank goodness. Uh, there was no actual GSA team? Ah. Oh. Well, I'm not one of them, but, you know. See, those aren't my names. None of these are my names. Oh, wait! Oh, no, that's not my name. Oh, oh, ah, oh, no, I'm not William Dubry Mills. Nor am I Dakota Kanetsky. Or JJ Housing. Nor am I Iman Mustafafi. These are some cool bloody names. Saka Sandra Duval. And, of course, Adam Orth. He's my favourite. Apart from Chris Butcher. His middle name's V. Thanks, Brandon Boyer. Thanks, Chris Pruett and Chris Heckler and Compulsion Games and Wikipedia. Wikipedia? Wikipedia, well-known source of... Whoa. Whoa, there's different save games and stuff? There's difficulties? So that was the ending. Now let's see if I can get. So what? They are waiting. Huh? Hmm. So let's see if we can I get the other more one. Important. Uh, okay. Oh my I god! Accelerate. Right. Okay. We cannot. That time is now. Core power. So can I activate now. this machine? This monument is powered. Oh, okay. If I yes, I can. For a moment, the machine will activate one of its functions. Let's go. Go go go. Go, go, Gadget Planet! Hey, Leon? Um, you're rising in altitude, and I would even say rapidly. Unless you feel like going wherever the core is going, you better get out of there fast. Oh, wow. I have the option of staying here. Probably not the best of ideas. <laughs> Although, I wonder what happens if you do stay. I'm going to have to find that out as well, aren't I? Holy f... Them is some terrifying ship blades. Well... We've doomed the solar system. Who 
Who knew? Like, we should tell NASA that you can, uh, you can power rockets with plants. It's a lot cheaper than all the oil and, well, whatever rocket fuel is made of. There we go! The journey begins. And now I'm guessing we get pretty much the same ending that we just got. Correct? Correct. Okay. Well, that's it then. So, uh, this has been Waking Mars. Thanks for watching. Um, there's not really much else to say, to be honest. There's not really any point in watching the cast for a second time, even though Chris the Butcher will appear again. Um, yeah, not much else to say. I'll see you guys next time for the next game, whatever that will be. Make sure to watch Pet in TV. That's the other game that I'm playing at the moment. And uh, yeah, hope you've enjoyed this. Catch you guys next time. Bye bye. And its functions. Right, there was one more thing that I needed to try, and that's going for a trip myself. Let's see what happens. Hey, Leon. I um, do. I do feel like going for a trip. I am with my new friends now, Armani. Oh, can you not go for a trip? Oh, lame. Oh, oh! Uh, am I going with this? <laughs> well, that's an ending, I suppose. Oh, I wish there was a way to skip this bit. We don't really need to see this again. Although that is a very cool design shit. Look at it go. Is it just me or is it flying away faster this time? Probably because it's got a human on board. They're like, oh wow, we've got one. Go, go, go. Get in the van. And that's it. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I'll see you again someday. Oh my god. And if that is not the true ending of Waking Mars, I don't know what is. Oh wow. Oh wow, this is actually a thing. Alert! It is 85.362%. Likely that standing at this exact location will cause a state of prolonged suspended animation. Oh god. That is correct, Art. It is the only way I will survive the journey to wherever we are going. It will be years or even decades. Can you switch to a low power mode that will allow you to last that long? Yes! Very good. It is time for us to sleep. I look forward to speaking with you when we arrive. Oh my god, that is the creepiest bloody ending in the world. Well, I'm sorry, I'm a little bit speechless to be honest. Uh, well, wasn't expecting that, okay. Well, I guess that's the ending of the video and the series then. Um, hope you enjoyed that creepy, terrifying ending with the... ...that just won't ever shut up. Whew. Well, uh, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.